He's he's why? No, because he's arrogant. I didn't have because time. Don't talk to him. Yeah. Sorry. Let's, go with him. You know what you're let's just talk about that. And let's talk about heteronormativity. Right, okay. Go on then. Uh, well, I mean, look. If yeah, you're are you a boy or a girl? So let's talk about I'm that. actually gender non-binary. I don't care what you are. It doesn't matter about what you are or what I am. Our children, and they grow up in our households, and we know it's not about you. This is the problem, isn't it? All of this is very subjective for you. Your whole life is about you. Your whole life is subjective. It's how okay. you see things. So, hi, I'm a queer Muslim activist, and I'm here to observe the protests and try to provide a counter-narrative as a queer Muslim to be visible as a Muslim and say, actually, there's nothing in the faith that compels you to be homophobic. People just genuinely want to have their voice heard, I think. It's a shame that they have to shout it by a megaphone and do it this way, but they just seem to want to have their voice heard. Hey, Muslims. Anna is a deliberate form of disruption to the Muslims. Alright, oh, okay, okay. Well, I'll talk to them later. Let's not cause an argument. We've got an interesting question. Do you think it's okay for four-year-old boys and girls to be sexualized? No. So this is what. Or, well, I don't think that's what they're doing. That's what the heart of the agenda is. I don't it's think they're, they're being. I don't, I don't. think they're being sexualized. Look at all the literature. Can here. I show? Can you show me? I'll bring across my uh, my dear friend here. Can I have a look? Can I film this? Do you mind? Film who? You want to film these images? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why not film these? Right. Okay. Look, we don't have anything against it. No, I know, I know, I know. I know. But stuff like this being pushed down the throats of little kids is right. not good. You're, you're concerned about some of the materials being shown to kids, yeah? Um, and you're going to show me some of the materials yeah, yeah. that they're showing? Yeah, definitely, definitely. Okay, so what about this one, first of all? What have we got here? We've got Heather has two mummies. What's wrong with that? Well, the thing is, you're not actually promoting um, different lifestyles. I mean, most of the people in the Muslim community are very much heterosexual, where a relationship involves male and a female, right. involves procreation. How are alternative lifestyles going to promote? What about having? What if? What if Heather had one mummy? But how is Heather having two mummies going to? Uh, okay. What if? More what if? What, what if? What if Heather had? What if Heather had one mum? Would that be a problem? None of these are problems. Well, none of these are problems. Okay, so problem. Heather has two mummies. It's a problem, it's a problem for a child. So There's see. a lot of problems for a child. Let's see another one. The transgender material. Yeah. Why don't you tell the LGBT community that nobody's more. against them? Right, show me some more. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, no, no. This is Just show me. Right. right. You talk about that. That one. You explain right. that one. Yeah. You are you a boy or are you a girl? Well, you know, in this, in this current, current debate about gender, shouldn't we be freeing ourselves from a gender binary? Are you a boy or a girl? Is, is okay, it, what's okay. the big deal with that? What's wrong with that? <laughs> But we are saying it's fine, but no. don't eat the children at the age of four. Wait a minute, let's just talk about that. And let's talk about heteronormativity. Right, okay. Go on then. Uh, well, I mean, look, if yeah, you're... Are you a boy or a girl? So let's talk about... I'm that. actually gender non-binary. I don't care what you are. It doesn't matter about what you are or what I am. Our children, and they grow up in our households, and we know it's not about you. This is the problem, isn't it? All of this is very subjective for you. Your whole life is about you. Your whole life is subjective. It's how okay. you see things. I'm and this is... We right, have an okay. objective... Can, have a, can we have a look at some more of them? Yeah, there's no need to stay on that one. Right, do you know what? There's nothing wrong with this one. So let's How do you mean there's nothing wrong with it? This is where it's all about. Are you a boy or a girl? Can we have a look at some no, more, no, please? No, 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 no. Why not? Let yeah, me see some more, I'll tell you why. Because it's school down in Slough. No, there's can, another... Right. Wait, can I just have... Can I, can can I, I, just have can I have these, please? Or otherwise, I'm not doing this. Can I just say... No, no, give me these. No, I want to look at the other one. I want to just do this one. I want to do transgender. Sorry. Our children are not transgender, they're only okay. four and five. Can, you, can I have a look at the other ones? Well, they, they belong to him. Well, well, then how am I supposed to discuss them if he's not going to show the me them? The discussion needs to be around the... Right, so let's see some more. No, the discussion needs oh, to be around the boy Can I have a look at the other ones, please? Which ones you want to have a look at? Let me see the other ones. 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 Enjoy these. Yes, enjoy these. Country. You've just shown the most gratuitous no, 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 one. You're Can I have a look at the... Why don't you be objective rather than be right. subjective yeah, for the material on there. Primary school yeah, sex and relationships you're education you're pack. You're in denial, my friend. You're in complete denial. I'm not. I'm just... You're making an argument that you can't even back up. I don't... I, I haven't... been delivered in schools. Okay, fine. Maybe... Maybe... I don't know. We'll have to check. I have to check that if that's true or not. Right, can I have a look at some more? Can I have a look at some more, please? Can I have a look at some more of them, please? GDTK. Hey, my son. Hey, 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 son. Hey,
ਤੁਸੀਂ ਲੈਸਬੀਅਨ ਕਿਉਂ ਆ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੇ ਸੈਕਸ ਕਿਉਂ ਚੇਂਜ ਕਰਨੇ ਤੂੰ ਕਿਉਂ ਇਹ ਕੈਮਰਾ ਸਾਰੇ ਨੂੰ ਕਿਉਂ ਲੈ ਲੈ ਕੇ ਤੇ ਕੱਟ ਕੱਟ ਕੇ ਫਿਰ ਤੂੰ ਲਾਣੇ ਨੂੰ ਜਿਸ ਮੇਰੇ ਲਿਸਨ ਨਹੀਂ ਐਸੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਕਰੂੰਗਾ ਸੌਰੀ ਆਈ ਡੋਨਟ ਨੀਡ ਟੂ ਲਾਫ ਯੂ ਮਦਰ ਐਂਡ ਥਿੰਗ ਤੂੰ ਵਾਈ ਆਰ ਯੂ ਟੈਲਿੰਗ ਯੋਰ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦਸ ਕਿਸ ਦਸ ਯੋਰ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਜੀ 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 ਦਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਮਾਈ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀਜ਼ ਵਾਲ ਆਰ ਯੂ ਮੁਸਲਿਮ ਹਾਂ ਮੈਂ ਮੁਸਲਿਮ ਹਾਂ ਓਕੇ ਦਿਸ ਟਾਈਮ ਨਾ ਵਾਈ ਡੋਨਟ ਯੂ ਟੈਲ ਦਾ ਮੀਡੀਆ ਦੈਟ ਥੀਸ ਪੇਰੈਂਟਸ ਹੈਵ ਨੋ ਪ੍ਰੋਬਲਮ ਬਿਕੋਜ਼ ਆਈ ਡੋਨਟ ਥਿੰਕ ਦੈਟਸ ਟਰੂ ਪਾਗਲ ਨੇ ਪੁੱਤਰਾ ਪਾਗਲ ਨੇ ਪੁੱਤਰਾ ਮੜ ਗਾਲ ਸੁਣਿਆ ਨਾ ਹੋਲਡ ਆਨ ਜੀ ਇਹ ਸਾਡਾ ਹੋਈ ਨਹੀਂ ਸਾਡਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਇਸ ਇਜ਼ ਨਾਟ ਦ ਰਿਕਾਰਡ ਨੋ ਹੀ ਕੈਨ ਆਈ ਹੈਵ ਰਿਕਾਰਡਡ ਇਟ ਹੀ ਕੈਨ ਟ੍ਰਸਟ ਇਟ ਸੋ ਆਈ ਲਿਸਨ ਨੋ ਆਮ ਨਾਟ ਰਿਕਾਰਡਿੰਗ ਐਂਡ ਆਈ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਡੂ ਅ ਫਿਲਮ ਵਿਦ ਯੂ ਹੋਲਡ ਆਨ ਅ ਮਿੰਟ ਥੋੜੀ ਦੇਰ ਮੇ ਕਰੇਗੇ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਇਹ ਜੋ ਹਾਂ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਤੂੰ ਆਪਣੇ ਆ ਜੇ ਤੇ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਕੀ ਦੱਸ ਤੂੰ ਗੱਲ ਤਾਂ ਕੋਈ ਬੰਦਾ ਇੱਥੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਤੁਸਾਂ ਨੇ ਖਿਲਾਫ ਕੀ ਯੂ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਹੈਵ ਅ ਬੋਏਫ੍ਰੈਂਡ that's fine if you want they want if i want don't i want don't want they want two mummies two daddies we don't care that's their life this is the i don't care if he's got a mic no, why no, is so right. suspicious of me but i don't it doesn't matter if you got the mic i'm not scared it doesn't matter oh no yeah i have to mind how like interrupting you should excuse me you particularly you now because you obviously in that same as them gg you, you don't like to get married to a girl like to get married to a girl so you as are you a muslim you should represent the muslims and say you know what don't cheat the children at that young age eh sat of the age sat dal rahe hai yeah mein problem mujhe karna hai ye nahi maine nahi kaha maine kaha no no but we trying to tell you that you should anybody as anybody you just should go to nobody to say you you should say so you should say to your community that you've got the wrong side of the stick these people are not against the gays i don't spoke what hold on hold on let me finish what's about having a big and we are we are saying we are not saying that why are they marrying boy boy why are they marrying girl girl we are not saying that because everybody's got their own rights whether you hear whether you hear. see you know these parents who are protesting nobody knows if their children might become older and become gay we are saying don't teach them at a young age let children be children they're too innocent so they're too innocent no this is you you're not in it so stop saying that you know you know you're covering your face anyway for goodness sake your face is covered anyway please unfortunately i've got I made a little guys I uh, just to clarify kind of I made a video with this man yeah. and I spoke to him very politely but you know what he did he posted all the videos on his YouTube except for mine why because he's 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 why no because he's an arrogant I didn't have because, time don't talk to him no don't, don't don't talk I to didn't him. have time to do your video right anyway right let's ask do our video I can I can I sorry can I just do this interview now please You don't like this uh, silly business Have you got children here No What are you here for huh? Can I just do my interview please No no Sorry Let's Go over there You know what to do You got that No 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 You're a shit game You got it Negative things about today unfortunately I've just been called bigheaded which is like unshameful and things like that simply for just engaging in an op- the you know in a discussion with these people i'm being called i'm being called did you call me bigheaded just there you called me bigheaded who called you that okay you uh, called me bigheaded uh, you called me shameful so anyway so i've unfortunately negative so the negative things the negative things have been that i've been called names like bigheaded which is unfortunate and uh, yeah that's that's been the negative so if communities are still fighting with each other how do we then move on from that? This is actually not about the LGBT community against Muslims. This is actually more about, you know, what is homophobia? We need to be we need to as Muslims actually realize that gay people have existed, always have existed, and always will exist. And the only reason that we don't see gay Muslims is because they're not visible because of homophobia. They've been driven underground to hide who they really are. and uh, this is this is why i came to challenge them today because i don't think that muslims should be in invi- gay muslims should be invisible anymore gay muslims should be able to be who they are be proud of who they are 
without this kind of intimidation, this kind of fear. I think that we've got a bit of an amnesia as South Asian people because back home in the South Asian subcontinent, you know, being a transgender, being Khaja Sera, being Hijra is very common, is very accepted. And actually transgender rights in Pakistan are even more advanced than in the United States of America. So we as South Asians, we need to remember that actually we already have LGBTQ people back in the homeland and we need to let them flourish like they did there. And unfortunately it was Britain that actually brought homophobia and queerphobia and transphobia over to the subcontinent mm -hmm. during the colonial period. I think that very unfortunately there, uh, there is a likelihood that these uh, protests will probably spread to other cities and uh, we'll start to see other schools in other cities um, challenging this LGBTQ inclusive RSE and they might even pull their children out of school. I personally don't think it's sustainable because the children are missing out on an education while this, this is happening. I mean, really, they don't have a choice in all of this, right? Now, what the parents need to understand is, is really the school curriculum that needs to be standardised and needs to be de 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 decided at a much higher level. Individual parents can't decide what goes into the cur curriculum. That just wouldn't work. So I think that the passion that the protesters are showing all comes from nothing more than deep homophobia. Because to have books that say, you know, Heather has two mummies, there's nothing wrong with these books. Heather does have two mummies. So there's no reason why these books shouldn't be shown to young kids. Absolutely no reason whatsoever. I can hug you, I can kiss you, I can, I, I can love you. So how am I homophobic? Okay, look, I give you guts. Okay, you're my brother. Okay, so why am I homophobic? <laughs> not a problem. Tika, tika, okay, you're tika. my brother. Yeah. Okay, don't be like, me. inshallah, we are not homophobic. You are our brother, inshallah. Hello, I'm not homophobic. Brother. Okay, I'm not homophobic. Inshallah, you're my brother. No. I'm Pakistani as well, nobody Me too, Afghan, yeah. my dad. So unfortunately, the people that are protesting, are South Asians, particularly Muslims, are disenfranchised from uh, mainstream society due to Islamophobia and racism. And it's only when we break those down that we can start to break down the homophobia within the society because they're only going to see homophobia as like, I've just been, <laughs> someone's going to slap me. Because they only. Muslims here. This is our kids' future that you're putting on sacred. Okay, guys, 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 stop. This is our kids' future. You got kids alone. You are yeah. dangerous. Start again. Yeah. Yeah. So, please, can we just do the interview no, for a second? You are posing our kids? Please. Right. You're not paying me. Can we just quickly finish it here? Right, huh? Right, okay. So, uh, the, pa the parents that are protesting here are disadvantaged. They are South Asian, particularly Muslim, and they experience Islamophobia, they experience racism. So, of course, they're going to feel disenfranchised. Now, whilst they do feel disenfranchised, they're going to uh, feel that any kind of like LGBTQ matters being discussed is because it's at odds with their faith in that interpretation it's going to feel like an assault on them it's going to feel like it's an agenda it's going to mm -hmm. feel like it's something that's being pushed onto them which it shouldn't be felt like that this is about loving relationships this is about happy families that come in all different shapes and sizes whether there's you know a mummy and a daddy one mummy two mummies Two daddies, two one daddies, daddies three daddies, who knows? Can I just please finish this interview? Can I please just finish the interview? Can I? No, that, you can't do that. So this is actually. Wait, I, I'll discuss Trojan Horse with you in a minute. My own personal opinion is that I think these books should be shown uh, to kids at primary school because there's really nothing wrong with them. And the earlier we get that message in, the earlier the better. Because what we're actually putting, what the parents want to put in really early on is some homophobia. Earlier so they the want to indoctrinate. Like you can, you, can someone please Rain take wash. him away? Rain wash. Rain wash. Please. Please. Just finish the interview first, then we can talk. I love your eyeliner. Beautiful eyeliner. What beautiful eyeliner. Right, so I think that the uh, books should be shown to children as early as possible because we need to stamp out homophobia as early as possible. There's nothing wrong with the books and uh, they should be shown to, to kids. The books themselves do not promote homosexuality because you can't promote homosexuality. You're either LGBTQ or you're not. You're not you can't make anyone gay any more than you can make them straight. 